Well, hello, it's uh, time for our Daily Bread again. I'm David, glad you're with us today. I think all of us are well aware of the concept of a knockoff. That is, you have a, a genuine article, a genuine item. A lot of times it's uh, expensive, valuable, uh, but then someone makes something that looks like the real thing, but it's not. It's, it's fake in that sense. Now, sometimes the knockoff uh, is of far lesser quality. Sometimes that's not necessarily the case. It's just something you're able to get that's like the original, but it's just a lot cheaper. Uh, the fact is, uh, Satan is in the knockoff business and he is exceptional at it. That is, you have the genuine article and then you have something else that's presented by Satan that is not the genuine article, but a lot of people buy into it. A lot of people uh, embrace it and accept it and, and want it. Uh, the problem here, though, is that the stakes are very, very high. You may be fooled sometime when you buy a knockoff of a genuine article. Sometimes you may knowingly uh, buy something that's a knockoff just because you don't want to pay the amount of money that would be necessary for the genuine. But with Satan, uh, we're dealing with something that uh, is eternally important. Now, specifically, I want you to think about what Paul talks about in Philippians the third chapter when he talks about righteousness. Uh, and he says there is a righteousness that's from God. But there's another kind of righteousness too. And this is a knockoff. It's not the genuine article. And if we miss this, then we're in serious trouble. Uh, this other righteousness is a righteousness, he says, of the law, comes from the law. It is a righteousness of my own. See, here, here's the deal. When we're talking about righteousness, we're talking about being right and doing right. We're talking about a right relationship with God. And Paul says that the righteousness that is from God is righteousness that is through faith in Christ Jesus. But oftentimes people believe their right standing with God comes from themselves. That is because I am good, because I do right, because I know what God says and I have brought my life into compliance with that. And you know, all of that's important. And it's necessary that we do that, but the righteousness doesn't come from us. It doesn't come from our keeping God's law. Our righteousness, as Paul says, is through faith in Christ Jesus. Our confidence, not in me, not my ability to obey, but my confidence is in Jesus Christ and what He has accomplished, and that I, through faith in Him, am able to have the righteousness that genuinely comes from God. It's the real thing. But Satan offers a knockoff. And many, and in this case, uh, we might even dare say most people, even most believers, uh, oftentimes are ones who are uh, embracing a knockoff. It's not the genuine article. Satan's good at what he does. And what, he's offer, what he offers looks like the real deal, but it's not. Let's not be satisfied when it comes to our faith, our relationship with God, our salvation. We must never be satisfied with anything other than the real deal, that which God offers, the righteousness that is through faith in Christ Jesus.